Thanksgiving and I wanted to give you guys a recipe video so today is Wednesday the 22nd it is day 16 10 and we are going to be making a um, casserole dish for Thanksgiving and I wanted to make it early so that I could give it to you guys so that you could make it on Thanksgiving but I'm pretty sure a lot of people know how to make green bean casserole but just in case you don't here is a how-to video on how to make green bean casserole casserole the way my mom makes it so this is the supplies that you will need the supplies you're going to need are crispy fried onions cream of mushroom soup green beans obviously milk and black pepper you're going to need one can of mushroom soup but we're going to double the recipe a three-fourths cup of milk one eighth teaspoon black pepper four cups of green beans and um one cup and one third French onions. So since we're gonna be doubling the recipe, um, each recipe calls for two cans of green beans. We're going to be putting four and doubling it instead. So if you see more or it looks like a lot, that is why, because I really love green beans and uh, my whole family really likes the casserole. So it's one of our favorites. So we make a lot of it here. So here's our other two cans of green beans ready to go. One of the key essential things of baking to me is to have a drink handy. <laughs> Water, Coke, I like to drink tea, Coke, something like that will like cook. I don't know if that's weird, but that's what I do. All right, step number one is to open all of the cans so that <laughs> You can just mix them all together. This can opener is so mean to me and never works properly. So opening these might take a little while. Okay, the recipe calls for three-fourths cup of milk, and again, I'm going to be doubling that because I'm going to be making uh, double the recipe. So that's what we're gonna add next. Okay, now we're gonna add one eighth teaspoon of pepper. Again, I'm doubling this. So, um, I don't have any pepper besides the one in here, so I'm just pretty much gonna have to pour it from this, but I'm going to be doing two of these for the double recipe. And then I'm going to be adding my cream of mushroom soup and mixing it together, and then we're gonna add the green bean. green beans which is so many green beans but um we're gonna mix this all together and then we're gonna add our crispy fried onions that's a whole lot of beans
Then you're gonna add two third cup crispy onions in there. Um, again, doubling the recipe, so just keep that in mind when you see this of me adding this. And this is what it's gonna look like. This is a lot of green beans. You can always just use the regular recipe, but this is double the recipe again. And um, now you bake it at 350, I think. Hold on. You bake it at 350, but I'm not going to do that step because, you know, obviously I don't need to make it tonight. But yes, 350 for 30 minutes or until um, hot, then put the remaining two thirds cup of um, fringe onion um, on top until golden. So, um, we are saving ours for Thanksgiving, obviously, so we're going to bake it tomorrow. But I just thought I would do the prep video type of thing for you and just explain to you <laughs> how to bake it because that part's not that hard. Um, and that way you can have um, amazing green bean casserole just like we do. And I hope you liked this recipe. <laughs> I, this is kind of like a silly, goofy, like, obviously you know how to make green bean casserole video. I feel like it's one of those videos of like, oh, here's how to pour cereal, <laughs> you know? And you do a whole recipe on how to properly pour cereal. That's how I feel, I feel kind of silly. But I got to do this video and got to do a Thanksgiving recipe video. And I hope you guys all have a happy Thanksgiving, a safe Thanksgiving. Tell me what you're thankful for in the comments. And I hope you guys will check out our Thanksgiving. <laughs> our thanksgiving vlog tomorrow we're going to be filming it. it is going to be up on friday so definitely check it out and i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for watching and we'll see you tomorrow